Hello, everyone. We believe the transition to a sustainable future requires small but smart decisions by millions of individuals. Let's talk about one of those decisions. Put yourself in the shoes of someone looking to buy a car. Maybe you want to make the green choice, and so you're thinking about a hybrid over a conventional car. But if you're like me, you need to think about your pocketbook. As you're shopping around, you can see right up front that the greener cars often have a higher sticker price. You can narrow your options for the car that's right for you based on things you can see up front, like the seating capacity, the spaciousness, the towing capacity, which cars have a sleek look, and even more. How green a car is and how much money you'll save from being green, however, is uncertain. It depends on how you drive, how hard you accelerate and brake, how far you go every day, how much traffic you get stuck in, what hills you go up and down, and more. And so you're left wondering, is the green car really right for me? I argue the uncertainty in the value of green is a barrier to choosing a green car. But if you're thinking about buying an EV, that uncertainty takes on a whole added dimension, range anxiety. You need to know for the way you want to drive your car, will you ever be in danger of running out of charge and getting stranded? Perhaps you want to know, do you need to charge at work to make your trips? Or if you forget to plug in your car one day, or if some jerk parks in your parking spot at work and you can't charge, can you still make your trips? So once again, the uncertainty is a barrier to choosing the green car. Wouldn't it be nice if the value of picking a green car or the range of the electric car for your driving were as clear as all the other things you think about when buying a car, like the sleek look or the number of seats? Wouldn't it be nice if you could get a virtual test drive to compare all the cars that you're thinking about for your driving? We are developing the solution. My green car is a technology that takes the uncertainty out of buying a green car. As a user, you simply install the app, choose all the cars that you're interested in, drive around in whatever car you have today, and the system computes for all the cars you're thinking about how they would stack up for your driving. We want to make my green car as easy and intuitive as Fitbit, but for people looking to buy a car. It sounds easy, doesn't it? I mean, it's just an app, after all. Thank you for the laughter. It's really difficult, actually. <laughs> What happens behind the scenes is really where the magic happens. Let's think about what happens in a car while it's driving. You have sinks of power and energy, such as aerodynamic drag, rolling resistance, and driveline losses, the power needed to accelerate you or drive you up a hill, and a lot more. To overcome all these sinks so that you can drive forward, you need power. Depending on the type of car you want to buy, the power can come from an internal combustion engine, a collection of motors and batteries, um, a fuel cell, or time-varying combinations of all of these. So for my green car, we need mathematical models to describe the sources and sinks of power, but for any possible driving condition by any possible driver, we have created that. Roughly speaking, we follow three steps. We need to formulate the models to figure out the right equations for each type of vehicle. We need to calibrate the models so that a particular set of equations describes one particular car. Then, we need to validate our calibrated models to prove that they're sufficiently accurate for the vast majority of driving conditions. Where it gets harder, though, there are nearly 1,200 unique vehicle models released every year by many different manufacturers. And so our equations need to be calibrated so that they're accurate for all these vehicles in any possible driving condition by any driver. Sounds tough, right? It is. 
There's hope, though. We've been working hard on my green car for quite a while. So far, we've formulated and calibrated vehicle physics models for almost 5,000 individual cars, covering almost all cars from model years 2010 to 2016. We focused extensively on validating our vehicle physics models against on-road and chassis dynamometer measurements. It's an effort that we're doing in partnership with our colleagues across the DOE national labs and the EPA. We have prototypes of our Android and iPhone apps, which are in the hands of many testers who have recorded tens of thousands of miles, thousands of hours, and thousands of individual trips. We've developed easy and intuitive visualization systems so that any user can see how any car they're thinking about compares for their driving at a glance. And we're transitioning our server systems to Berkeley Labs supercomputers so that we can handle the computational requirements from millions of people using our system when they're looking to buy a car. So in other words, we're putting the power of DOE's supercomputers into the hands of car buyers to take the uncertainty out of choosing a green car. Our team's objective is to accelerate the deployment of green cars. With this social impact focus, we've partnered and are working closely with the US EPA and DOE, who see my green car as the pathway to the next generation of fuel economy labeling for all cars, and a way to remove range anxiety as a concern for EV car buyers and owners. The EPA runs a website called fueleconomy.gov, which gets 50 to 55 million unique users every year. In partnership, with EPA and DOE, we're working hard to bring my green car to all these users. So we're fortunate to already have a captive audience and a channel to reach that audience. Our ultimate goal is to help every car buyer understand the environmental benefit, fuel savings, and payback time they would achieve in any car they're thinking about for their own driving. In other words, we're bringing science solutions into the hands of every car buyer to take the uncertainty out of choosing a green car. We're not just creating another app. We're not even creating an app that you would use every day. We're creating an app and a system that takes the uncertainty out of a critical decision point, the car buying process, which has long lasting implications on energy consumption and greenhouse gas emissions. We're creating an app to empower millions of individual people, fleet operators, utilities, and everyone else who thinks of buying a car to make the small, smart, and long-lasting choices towards that sustainable future. Thank you.